Well, this is the kind of thing that uh, obviously we're trying to avoid. This is the kind of situation actually that contractors and regulators alike want to avoid. In such a condition, we would have uh, high erosion rates, we would have high sediment yield rates, uh, probably on-site damage, off-site damage, the topsoil to uh, provide lawns for those uh, houses in the background is now running down the hill slope and into the drainage channels and perhaps uh, into waterways later on. So the idea here is, when we talk about why use Russell in your work, the idea is to prevent these sorts of things and some of the less desirable things that can come along with it, such as Clean Water Act violations and things such as that. How do you learn to do this kind of stuff on your own for yourself? Just like any sophisticated computer program, whether it's Word, Excel, PowerPoint, TR-55, HECRAS, any of those programs that uh, you might use in your day-to-day -day practice, the study and the practice are required to produce satisfactory results. Just as you didn't learn to use all the bells and whistles in Excel in an hour, on four, or even HECRAS, or even TR-55, we can't teach you all that stuff in one hour. But hopefully, we can get you excited about the prospects because of that versatility within Russell and because of its pedigree going back 70 years and providing the best possible erosion estimates uh, for your particular custom sites. We've talked, uh, taught many groups to use Russell too effectively in two days of training, and we've really taken about 16 hours of, of training that we give uh, in the past in various venue and uh, digested that down to a one-hour highlight film. You'll find that uh, we're very enthusiastic about the Russell model and its applicability to construction sites and uh, using it as a tool for erosion control, designing erosion control practices.